Hi, this is Dunk Sergeant. Welcome to the Karst Valley Railroad. All aboard! This is part two of N-Scale Modeling with Floral Foam. Today I'm uh, putting together the smaller buttresses. This time I'm going to glue them first and then cover them with plaster. And we're going to paint them up. Here we go. So I found that the floral foam is delicate enough that I can just cut it using a straight edge. And I use a small straight edge to create the the layers. And of course I uh, have to come back in with a little clay tool to make the joints in between the blocks. And then I'm going to cover this with the white glue, Mod Podge, to kind of seal the foam so that the plaster doesn't erode it. And I just put enough to get into those cracks. And this is after it's set up. So then I take the plaster, which I'm using a more dilute plaster mix this time around and it's working better again I don't put so much on to actually fill in the mortar joints for painting I'm using the army painter quick shade washes set and the war games hobby starter paint set this is fairly inexpensive and will give me what I need I'm painting all four pieces with a light gray concrete color five parts white to three parts black comes out pretty good. Notice that there's bubbles, holes, and I'm just going to pretend that that's exactly what I wanted. My next step is to put some white on, and this is a semi-dry brush. Next I'm using a soft tone wash, sort of a rusty color, brown mud dripping off the bridge and that takes off that bright white quite a bit. And that looks nice and grimy. Plenty of character. Now I'm taking a green tone wash and going along the base of the buttress. This is down by the river. There's going to be grass nearby. And maybe the moss is growing up the wall. So I think that looks pretty good. And as a bonus, I got out the portal and did the same process with the gray and then sort of a white on top of it, the dry brush again. The trouble is, <laughs> I don't think I waited long enough for the paint to dry because the white basically disappeared. So I've got the black at the top of the portal and I'm doing the brown mud color and then some uh, green and then a black on the back. But because I was kind of rushing, it all turned out dark. So it's much darker than the foam ones. And, you know, I haven't actually painted in years. <laughs> so this looks interesting. It's good enough for now. And it's, like I said, it's been 30 years since I've painted anything. That's good enough. That's about it. I'm Dunk Sergeant with the Cars Valley Railroad. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Over and out.